What is this? Hmm. Uh, what is that? Um. It's like this disc thing, and it when you put a disc on it, it like plays music. It's like a CD recorder. An old-fashioned a um, movie player. Um, uh, like <laughs> I've seen one of these before. I don't you like put like a disc here, and it's like. <gasps> I forget what this does. Like, I'm pretty sure it makes like music or like sounds. I think it plays like, um, pretty sure you put like a CD right there. It's an old time, uh, like a little baby old time recorder that you, if you put a CD in that, round thing you, it plays music or uh, that's only if you put that thing on top of that oh i've actually haven't seen one but i've heard of one well i know this is a record player um kind of looks like a toy one because it's more colorful than my dad than the one my dad has oh i know what this is i used to have one of these but mine was red I love this. This is a record player. Like, maybe like turn this up because how I see a off right there. Oh, this one it says volume, so that raises the volume when you crank it like that. And then, well, you just put a CD in here, and then you put that thing on, and then it just plays. And you would turn it on first, and then you would, um, you would move it, you would put the record on first, and you would turn it on, and you would move it over, and it would play the whatever was like on it. And so, like, it might be like this, or like this. Like, maybe like this makes it like a lower sound, and this turns it off. No, I mean like on, all the way. And then you put this on the CD, and it like spins, and it like, make sounds and you can like turn the volume up or down and the thing would spin and, it, and the needle right here which would usually be where the needle is it would spin and there would be like a record here and it would play music because it would scratch the needle would kind of scratch this thing you take it and then it spins around it to make it to make it actually play Put this over this and then it spins. Maybe if I do that. Oh, it's like, oh, it's like one of those things rappers use. It off and on. And then when you go up to 33, it kind of gets a little bit louder, but then when you turn it up to 45, it gets really loud. Put records around here, and there's usually an arm that you put down on the record, and then you press the button to pull, to move it around. Take your record, and you put it on, and then you turn the switch. Well, you move the handle over, which has a needle. Not like a needle you poke your hand with, but then you turn it on, it moves, and you can move the volume up and down for however loud you want it.
is it? And I put it on there. Wait, can you do it on this side too? And I've seen this from a cartoon. It just doesn't look exactly like this. Because it's like the thing is like up here and you put it down. And it's not like this. And there's like this little turny piece. Okay. Right, thank you. Oh, look okay. it. Fancy. roller skated around our basement. Awesome. So fun. Engravings on each side. If you were to look closely, you could see a little bit of the engravings. But it's kind of hard to. You can because it has so many scratches on it. That's why you probably it's kind of like a regular DVD, but it plays music and doesn't show pictures. And if you want a different song on the same side, there's the there's striped streak things on the side, and um, there's like a circle around something. You put it on that circle of black, and then it'll just and then you start it, and it'll start playing a different song. I'm sure in the in the regular DVD it would kind of be similar to this, but this is more old fashioned, so. One would be this first line, two, three, and then you just go on. On the list, there's that. And then the other side, there's a different one, a different song choice. It's much bigger, I gotta say. Um, now they have, they just have like little iPods, and then they just tap a button, plug their earphones in, and then they just put it in their pocket, and then they have music. Mm -hmm. um, but a little bit after this, they had DVDs that only played music, and there would be it would be much more compact, and it would just you would put a tiny CD much smaller than this, about the size of this actually. If you want like long-lasting things and stuff like this, a uh, record player would be nice. But you would just put it in. I actually used to have one, but it stopped working after a while because it was fairly old. Some people, it's hard for you to learn how to use a record player and how to clean them too. You have to clean the records very often because you see this one's a bit dirty and also you have to clean the needle up here um, because at our house we always get cat hair on the needle and it doesn't play very well. Maybe we listen to music like we kind of use radios or we have this app Pandora or something and we have actual phones that we actually like have earbuds so we can listen to it but in the oldies days they kind of had these discs and they played it at restaurants and stuff because they didn't have because they didn't really have music because at restaurants now they play music from the speakers and they have something back there that plays it but back in the oldies days they used to use these things so 